What's up, family? Daria Elizabeth here. So excited to join you for another episode. In this one, we're going to be talking about what to do in times of trouble. Psalms 27 verse 5 says, In the time of trouble, he shall hide me in his pavilion. What is a pavilion? A pavilion is a place of covering. It is a place of safety. It is a place of shelter. It is a place where a person is able to be protected. Many times in this life, we bump into things and run into things and come into things that seem to throw us off. But God himself is a pavilion. God himself is a refuge. He is a place of safety, a place of shelter, a place where you can go and find comfort. The word of God says, when you pray to him about various issues, and when you seek him on many things, that he will give you the peace that this world cannot understand. Guys, there's a peace that this world cannot comprehend. There is a level of serenity, a level of quietness, a level of safety that this world does not understand that God gives when we cry out to Him. It is so imperative that we trust in Him and lean on Him and bring everything to Him in prayer. Because when we do, then we understand what His will is. If we don't come to Him in prayer, we won't understand His will. The only way that you finally discover what it is that God is trying to do is when you pray. Sometimes some things take fasting and it's a necessity for you to fast. But the only way for you to genuinely discover what the will of God is, is when you talk to Him. It's like if you're in a relationship with someone, if you don't talk to them, you're not going to know how they're feeling, what they're thinking, what's going on with them, if they're upset, if they're happy, if they're sad, if they're, you're not going to know. But when you open your mouth and communicate with that person, then you very well know what's on their mind, what's on their heart, what their plans are, what they're going through, what they're experiencing when you open your mouth and talk to them. Same thing with the father. Why do we think it's any different? When you open your mouth and talk to the Lord, He will unveil to you His heart. He will unveil to you His will. He will show you what it is that He prefers, what He wants, what He desires, and what He's thinking. And isn't that what it's all about? Trusting the Lord with all of your heart and not relying on your own conscience or your own understanding or your own wisdom or your own strength or skill. Isn't that what this whole thing is about? In the time of trouble, he shall hide you. He only hides you when you come to him. My encouragement is, in the time of trouble, run into him. Don't run to alcohol. Don't run to drugs. Don't run to sex. Don't run to others necessarily. Run to him. He is the maker. He's the one that created you. He's the one that knows you. He's the one that has you in the palm of his hands. In the time of trouble, he shall hide you when you run.